I'm love herself. I'm posting this information to say a little something about myself. That's uh, it's not out there. It's not known about me as much. It's out there just a tad bit, but anyway. I'm the original writer of a show being called Living Single. And I needed to say this because there has been some injustice about it. And so, for starters, I wrote that show. It was a play at the time. And there was a summoning of playwrights during the time I was living in Hollywood. So, to make a long story short, I answered the summoning and I went over to uh, Franklin Avenue in, uh, in Hollywood. It was a theater there called the Lincoln Center. And at the time, there was a family there that was a part of the conducting of, of the, the summoning by the name of uh, Lee, a Lee family. And when I got there, it was crowded with other playwrights that were wanting to submit their plays as well. And I get there and, and their plays were being reviewed by producers and what have you. And this was back in the 70s. And so my play took an interest once I submitted it to be reviewed by a Yvette Lee Bowser. She had, um, so I skimmed through it, and I think back on it, and she was interested, and so I was excited. I said, that play took a lot of work, day and night. You know, I lost a lot of sleep, but I was happy to do it because it was one of my comedy plays. I write other plays as well. And so, as it was closing, the, um, summoning was, was closing, I noticed that uh, my play was being kept on the table. And so as I go to retrieve it, I was told that, can you let that stay with us? You know, so she picked it up and wanted, she said, she said she wanted to look at it a little further. And so I said, okay. And so I had to be good news, you know, it's not for me to go back to, to my little ones. I had two sons at the time that my plan would be accepted, possibly. So 